Title. Comparison between gravity and pressurized systems for water distribution. Slide. 1. Introduction. Gravity and pressurized systems are two commonly used methods for water distribution in plumbing and water supply networks. In this presentation, we will compare and contrast gravity systems and pressurized systems, examining their principles, components, and advantages. Slide 2. Gravity system. A gravity system relies on the natural force of gravity to distribute water. It utilizes a higher elevation water source, such as a reservoir or water tower, to create pressure and allow water to flow to lower-lying areas. Gravity systems are commonly used in rural areas, where the topography facilitates the distribution of water by gravity. Slide 3. Pressurized system. A pressurized system uses mechanical devices, such as pumps or pressure tanks, to generate and maintain water pressure. Water is pumped into the distribution network under pressure, allowing it to reach all areas of the system. Pressurized systems are prevalent in urban areas, buildings, and complex water supply networks. Slide 4. Principle of Operation. Gravity System. Water flows downhill due to gravitational force, utilizing the potential energy of the higher elevation source. The height difference between the source and the distribution points determines the pressure and flow rate. Pressurized System. Water is pumped into the distribution network creating pressure that forces water to flow through the pipes. Pressure is maintained by pumps or pressure tanks, ensuring consistent water supply to all areas of the system. Slide 5. Components. Gravity system. Water source. Reservoir or water tower at a higher elevation. Gravity pipes or channels to carry the water downward. Distribution points at lower elevations to access the water. Pressurized system. Pumps or pressure tanks to generate and maintain pressure. Pipes and valves to transport and control the flow of water. Distribution points equipped with fixtures, such as faucets and outlets, for water usage. Slide 6. Advantages of gravity systems. Reliance on natural forces, reducing energy consumption and operating costs. Simplicity of design and operation, requiring minimal mechanical components. Suitable for areas with favorable topography and sufficient elevation differences. Lower maintenance requirements compared to pressurized systems. Slide 7. Advantages of pressurized systems' flexibility to distribute water to any location regardless of topography. Consistent water pressure throughout the system, ensuring reliable water supply. Ability to serve multi-story buildings and complex plumbing networks. Enhanced control over water pressure and flow rate for various applications. Slide 8. Limitations of gravity systems dependent on topography and elevation differences, limiting their applicability in certain areas. Lower pressure and flow rates compared to pressurized systems, affecting water delivery in higher or distant locations. Potential challenges in supplying water to elevated areas or multi-story buildings. Slide 9. Limitations of pressurized systems. Higher energy consumption due to the need for pumps or pressure tanks. Increased complexity in design, installation, and maintenance. Susceptibility to pump failures or power outages, leading to disruptions in water supply. Slide 10. Conclusion Gravity systems and pressurized systems offer distinct advantages and considerations for water distribution. Gravity systems are cost-effective, energy-efficient, and suitable for areas with suitable topography. Pressurized systems provide flexibility, consistent pressure, and adaptability to various building types.